today we take on the ultimate Mario Party Superstars challenge. I'll see if I can defeat myself. I control all four characters at the same time with the exact same input, and I'm not going to take it easy on myself. I'm gonna try to take myself down so that I can come out on top. I hope you enjoy this video. Hey folks, this is Yoshi's Tropical Island, capiche? Wait, you're all Yoshis? What's going on? And all the Yoshis cheer together. The Koopa's looking at them like, what? Oh, I get it. You're all going to battle it out to find out who's the ultimate Yoshi. Hey, I've got some business to take care of. I'll see you folks later. Mushroom Head is gonna take care of you folks. Got it? You got it! First, we'll decide the turn order! Hi, I'm Mushroom Head. I'd like to decide the turn order! Do you think my real name is Mushroom Head? First, we'll decide the turn order! Cyan Yoshi is first! Yellow Yoshi is the one that comes after first! Blue Yoshi is third! Red Yoshi is last, but not least! First, we'll decide the turn order! Oh, we already did! Here are some coins! And everyone is given 10 All coins right. to start off! Alright! And where's the turn order? Wow! I just realized that you're all Yoshis! Good luck, everyone! What a great start to the game. I had a lot of fun with changing that text there. I edited the text in the game so that it would say this since we're all Yoshis. So let's get started. We are playing as all four characters together. This is very exciting. I really hope that I can take myself down and win this one. I'm not going to be showing any mercy to myself. This is a Yoshi eat Yoshi world over here. Okay, we got a nine over here. All right, that's pretty good. I'm going to play rough. I am not afraid to steal from myself. If I have to steal from myself, I'm not going to be afraid to steal from myself. I am not at all going to be worried about that. Oh my goodness, a one. Okay, so I might get the bonus star for who lands on the most event spaces. But then that means that I won't get it because I'll be the only one getting it, so I won't be able to get it. The star is over on the left island now. Okay, and only one more Yoshi to go. Go ahead and roll a seven. Okay, so we've got two Yoshis. The two blue ones are getting pretty low rolls. Everyone else got some pretty decently high rolls. Okay, what is our first minigame? Let's see what we will have. What is our All first right. minigame? Okay, one versus three minigame. Everyone versus dark blue. And it is... Piranha Pursuit. What if we just do nothing? Oh, oh, it'll catch up to me. <laughs> I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run. Gotta run. Let's see, who should I make win this? I don't know who I should make win this. Whoa! Okay, okay, okay. It got me, it got me. I was wondering if you could mash B to move very quickly while you're in the air. But it's just like a real skateboard. You can only gain speed while you're on the ground. Okay, so it looks like blue is in last place. Everyone else is in first. So I'm in first, 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 and fourth so far. All right, light blue Yoshi, Cyan Yoshi gets a seven over here. We are going to, of course, be heading up this way. Your turn, yellow Yoshi. And we're probably passing by the shop, right? Do we reach the shop? You know, let's buy an item. We are going to buy... Let's get... A double dice block. We're gonna play it risky. Get a double dice block. And it's funny that when you are going through the shop menu, it's like everyone is pulling up the stickers like this. Okay, but we land on a lucky space. What do we get from the lucky space? Maybe some coins. Coins would probably be the best. 15 coins! Okay, we could already afford the start. And we got a double dice block, so we might actually be able to reach the star next turn. I might actually just use that double dice block right away. Oh my goodness, a 10. That's a nice big roll. It looks like I'm catching up to myself over here. All right, heading up this way. Oh, but I'm going to Bowser. I might be causing trouble for myself by going to Bowser over here. Man, this blue Yoshi looks so good. You guys can let me know in a comment which Yoshi you are going to be rooting for over here. Which Yoshi do you want to win? Everyone gives 10 points to Bowser. That's so sad. Kind of cool that we get to see all the Yoshis over here together, though. All the Yoshis over here. They look so good. Man, the colors of these Yoshis are just so great. We've got such nice, vibrant colors. Okay, you get a three, so we're also going to continue up this way. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, okay, okay, yellow can still afford the star. I'm like, wait, how can yellow still afford the star? Wait, it's everyone versus blue again? That's what happened last time. Oh, no. Oh, no, let's see. Let's see, what is it? River Raiders. Huh, who do I want to get a lot of coins? You know what? Because, look, wherever I go, everyone follows. This is going to be so weird. Okay, let's see. I'll go for this coin then. Oh, man. All right, no. No, okay. Can I get the money back? No, they can get it, though. Here, I'll let you guys get the money back. Okay, there. But I'm getting this money back. Sorry, guys. I'm taking this one here. Okay, you guys can go over there and get some of those. Oh, no, I want this one, though. Yeah, I'll let you guys get that. I'll take these over here. Oh, man, there's something. You know, I'm going over here just so you guys can get that because I want there to be as many coins as possible in the game. So, blue at the front had to take a hit just so everyone at the back could go and get some more money there. All right, but everyone's pretty happy about this. Blue gets 10 coins. Everyone else gets a lot of coins. I think it was like 21 or so. See, 21 coins for all of them. That's so many. We are going to be seeing a lot of stars. Well, maybe we're going to be seeing a lot of stars in this game. 
Everyone's me, so hey, I played this game pretty well. I managed to beat this game literally without touching my controller. I beat this game with only pressing the A button multiple times without using the joystick. So we might have some situations where things end up getting pretty intense here. Okay, so we're just buying a mushroom over here. Nothing super special. Just want to head across. Just Oh, oh, and we get a hidden block already. First hidden block of the game. Just coins, just coins. It's too bad that it's not a star. 12 coins, oh, that's a lot. 49 coins, that brings that Yoshi into first place. Okay, we are 10 away. So, it's too bad that we don't have a custom dice block. If we bought a custom dice block the previous turn, then we would have been able to guarantee it reach it. But let's see, will we roll at least a 10? I see three. We need at least a seven. Odds are we don't get it. Oh my goodness! We got exactly a seven! Oh my goodness, we are exactly reaching this star. This is exactly the kind of luck I need to beat myself. When we are controlling all characters together, that is exactly what we need over here. All right, man, I'm really showing myself today, getting the first star over here just like this. Man, do I even stand a chance against myself? I got a really lucky roll like that, got the first star. Let's see, maybe I'll be able to come back. Oh man, Blue is actually doing horrible. Blue is very, very unlucky right now. Should I maybe try to get a warp block with blue? No, I'll go, I'll go for a mushroom. I'll go for a mushroom. Let's go for a mushroom. Play it kind of safe. Not getting something super expensive, but adding a plus five to our dice roll might be very beneficial at some point. And we're landing on a lucky space. If we get a bunch of coins, that would be amazing. Item bag would be nice too. Ah, warp block. Ah, oh, man. I was actually somewhat considering getting a warp block because that could be a very trolly item. Like if someone's right in front of the star, you could switch spots with them. Okay, and red gets a six. Man, blue, dark blue is just so far behind. Dark blue is very unlucky over here. Okay, and you know what? We're actually gonna go for a custom dice block over here so we could play very safe over here. So we could basically, I think, maybe guaranteed reach the star next turn. Because I think we're going to be less than 10 away from the star right now. 10 or less away. Let's see, how many spots is that? One, two... Probably less than 10. Okay, what's our minigame? Four player minigame? It is... It is... Mush Pit! This is going to be so weird playing as all four characters. I can basically choose who I want to win. And you know what? Dark Blue is in fourth place, so you know what? Let's give Dark Blue a chance. Okay, let's do this. Hopefully someone else doesn't get the mushroom. Oh my goodness, it's literally the last one I checked. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, but if everyone survives, does everyone win? Maybe I'll try and avoid that then. That's like the Yoshis, they all want to avoid the mushroom. Ah, we don't want to get the mushroom. Let's just spin around like this. Spinning Yoshis are scared of the large mushroom. So I'll run into this corner here. Okay, I'm gonna try and avoid the mushroom and I'm gonna see what happens if all four characters survive the entire time. Hopefully that will happen. You know what? Have you guys ever seen the DVD logo pop around his screen and then it pops around? And you wanna see like when it lands in the corner because it's very satisfying when it goes exactly in the corner. Oh, oh, it's getting pretty close to the corner. Will it bounce along the corner? No, it didn't. Oh no, oh no, I've gotta avoid that, I've gotta avoid. Okay, it's actually getting kinda of close, okay. Let's see, oh, and we can all ground pound together. What if we get on the last second? Ah, I wanted to get on the last second. Wait, is everyone in first? Everyone is in first, everyone gets coins, okay. Okay, so that's what happens if everyone does nothing here. Well, we didn't do nothing, it's just we didn't purposefully eliminate each other. Okay, so I think it's good to have more coins on the board. We gotta have some good competition over here, you know? All right, Cyan, what are you gonna do? Eight away, you know what? Let's use the mushroom. Let's use the mushroom. I think using the mushroom is a good idea. Oh my goodness, and again, we got just the exact number that we needed to reach the star. Would you look at that? We needed to roll at least a three to reach the star, and we actually got it. This has happened twice in a row now. First, Yellow got exactly the number that Yellow needed with the double dice block to reach the star. Now, Cyan was able to just reach it just like that. Okay, but right now, Yellow has traveled the most spaces because Yellow is the farthest ahead. Everyone start on the same spot. Oh, he didn't pass by the Koopa for an extra 10 coins yet. But a hidden block, maybe another star, another star maybe? Nah. When you're in first place or second place, it seems like very often you don't get stars. Well, I guess maybe that's maybe that's just a coincidence. Okay, we are nine away. Wait, but we can't afford the star actually. So we want to get an eight or less. We get a seven. Okay, that's even better because an eight would have been an event panel. So you know what? Everyone is getting basically the best rolls possible. Like I couldn't be asking for anyone to get better rolls. Okay, and what will we want? You know what? Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do something crazy. Here, we're gonna do something crazy here. We're gonna do this. Let's roll a 10. Let's see, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna roll a 10. So we're passing by the star, and I'm pretty sure that we are landing on a versus space. All right, let's go. We land on a versus space. And let's see how many coins. I'm not gonna look, I'm not gonna look. I'm just gonna, just gonna mash A. Just gonna mash A, and let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. 
How many coins is it? 10. Okay, not a humongous deal, but if Blue can win this one, that would be fantastic. Let's see, what's the minigame gonna be? What's it gonna be? Storm Chasers! Start. Okay, who do I want to win? You know what? Let's have Blue win, because Blue doesn't have a lot of coins. Blue is the farthest back in terms of coins. So let's try and get a lot of rain over here for Blue. Man, Cyan's almost trying to win over there. Cyan, Cyan, it's not your turn. Cyan, get out of the way, Cyan. We need Blue to win. Yeah, Cyan actually did get a lot of rain. I don't know if Cyan can actually... I don't know if Cyan might accidentally come in first. Cyan's probably going to be in second. I don't know who's in third. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, I think I managed to let Dark Blue win. I think Dark Blue's first, Light Blue's second. I don't know who's third and fourth. Let's see. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Exactly as I predicted. Okay, and then it turns out Red is third and Yellow is fourth. I didn't know about those two, but everything else went exactly as planned. So now Blue will be able to afford this star, which is very nice. 28 coins, that's a lot. Okay, Red can't afford the next star yet, but Red is all the way back here, so Red has some time to get some more coins before making it to the star again. Okay, one versus three minigame. Who do I want to win this? Probably the team of three, right? Let's see. Hide and sneak. This is so silly. This is so silly. This is so silly. Okay, everyone's going to hide behind the same spot every time. Because no matter what button I press, I can't make all the Yoshis hide at the same spot. Because when I press a button, all three Yoshis are behind the bushes right now. Yeah, there we go. And... Round number two, I can pick where the Yoshis go, I can make them go wherever I want. I can hit this button, make them hide behind the rocks now. Now they're gonna hide behind the rocks. So let's see, let's just push this button over here. Now they're all behind the rocks. Wait, what the? How are they, what? How did they split up like that? I hit the X button, everyone should have been back there. Okay, I'm gonna hit X a bit, then A a bit. Okay, now I'm gonna mash A a lot. Let's see if they're all behind the bushes or if some of them are behind the rocks. That's so weird that that one Yoshi didn't listen. What happened? Yeah, no one's behind the rocks now. Everyone's behind the bushes. That was so weird. That one Yoshi has a will of its own. It didn't listen. What happened? I have no idea what happened with that Yoshi. That Yoshi's trying to throw the game. That Yoshi's trying to lose on purpose. He wants to sabotage his team. He wants to try to make dark blue when they're colluding together. All right, light blue, go ahead and roll. Light blue rolls a six over here. Okay, so we're getting some points. We're passing by Mr. Koopa Troopa over here. Thank you for those coins. And we are landing on an item space. I think this might be the first item space of the game. Okay, let's go like this. Let's go like this. And now, there we go. Look at that, speed running, getting the first item. The timer still said 10 seconds. If you don't mash fast enough, then you'll just get Bowser Jr. But uh, we did some very fast A buttons there, so we managed to get the mushroom before it became nine seconds left. That was a nice speed. Okay, please don't roll a one. Don't roll a one. Okay, a seven. Wait, that doesn't bring us to an event space, does it? Let's see. Oh, right, and everyone's getting ten points for passing by this Koopa Troopa. We're getting even more coins now. Let's see. Oh, stopping right before the event space. Well, even if we were going to land on the event space, then we would have been able to go the other way. Do I use the mushroom now? Do I use the mushroom now? Or do I use the warp block? Oh, this would be crazy. Do I use the warp block and give someone else a chance to win? What if Blue Yoshi's like, hey, you know what? I don't really want to win. I'm right in front of the star. I'm going to use a warp block and give one of you guys a chance to win. Should I do that or should I go? Let's go. Let's go. Let's do this. We'll use the mushroom right now. No, everyone's got to try to win. I'm not, I'm not losing to myself. I'm going to try to win. Okay, we get that. Wait. All right, so we get a roll. We are able to reach the star, guaranteed able to reach the star no matter what now that we use the mushroom because the mushroom gives us plus five. So Yoshi does, in fact, purchase the star and every single Yoshi has a single star now. Very close game in terms of stars and anyone might win depending on how the bonus stars go. But in terms of coins, we do have quite a bit of a spread here with dark blue and red being very far behind. Oh, but we get a custom warp, uh, custom dice block, not custom warp block, a custom dice block over here. And yeah, it looks like a dark blue is in fact in last place, but what do we get? Okay, we got a seven, so we're getting 10 coins. Closing in on the others, but the others have coins in the 60s, so they are pretty far ahead. But yeah, this game can still go, this game can still go anywhere. Okay, and let's see, what do we get from the lucky space? We get also a custom dice block. All right, those might come in handy. And there might be a bonus star for who lands on the most Bowser space. I think Dark Blue has landed on a Bowser space. Okay, bonus minigame, double coins. What is it? Okay, one versus three minigame. 
And let's see, what will we have? Spotlight Swim! Wait, will I even be able to catch everyone? Let's have everyone just go to the top right. Okay, there we go. Okay, it was really weird how the lights weren't showing up. And look at that! The blue Yoshi is by the blue spotlight, the red one's by the red spotlight. If only we had a green one by the green spotlight. He does have green shoes, though. That's so cool how they match up over there. Alright, the team of three did pretty good there. Five turns are left. Those are the last five turns! Let's take a look! Current standings! Okay, so Yellow Yoshi is in first, Cyan Yoshi's in second, Red is in third, and Blue Yoshi is in fourth. So who are they going to choose as the possible victor? Who is going to be given the prize? Let's see. Cheap Cheap, who do you choose? <laughs> Blue Yoshi! Okay, okay. What are they gonna give Blue Yoshi as a prize? Gold pipe, maybe? Golden pipe! Let's go! It's time for this Yoshi to start coming back. Now that we're in the home stretch! Okay, so blue space will give you six, red will make you lose six, and if two players land on the same space, a duel will begin. This is going to be crazy. It is still anyone's game. I think if a duel happens, everyone should risk all of their coins. Okay, we get a seven. That brings us. Let's head up here, head towards the shop. Hey, everyone wants to head towards the shop, because you know the shop will now have gold pipes, which will be a pretty big deal. A three, okay. Not super- wait, wait, wait. Oh, no, they're not on the same spot. That's too bad. No duel yet. You know what? I think it would be a good idea right now to use our custom dice block and roll- Oh, or I could have actually used the warp block. That might be a not bad time to use a warp block. Okay, now we'll roll a 10. So we will head up this way. We will get past these guys. We'll be passing by over here. We can buy another gold pipe. So we will now have two gold pipes, but we can't afford any stars. Hopefully, we will be able to afford both of those stars by the end of the game. And let's see, we're landing on a lucky space. If we get coins here, that'd be amazing. 17 coins would just be perfect. Let's see. 10! Okay, 10's still alright. 10's still alright. You can still afford the next star, that's alright. Playing a little risky here, a little scary. And you know what? We are also going to use the custom dice block. Okay, everyone's just using stickers as I'm trying to make my way through the menu and select what I want to do. Okay, let's go, let's go. So we also roll a 10, so it looks like red and blue, they want to catch up now. Okay, so red's also buying a gold pipe over here, down to 30 coins. We can afford the next star, and red and blue are also kind of close to the next star. So let's see, what do we get over here? We get... Double dice block, okay! So it's quite likely that red is reaching the star next turn, even if we don't use the gold pipe. All right, a four-player minigame, what is it gonna be? What are we gonna have? We have Honeycomb Havoc, oh my goodness. Start. Who do we want to win? You know what? I actually really want Dark Blue to win. We kind of want red to get some coins too, so let's do this, let's do this. And this is so weird, it's like I can choose exactly who I want to win. I can choose who I want the winner to be, as long as I play somewhat carefully and I don't make too many big mistakes. Okay, let's go like this. Let's get a one over here. And let's just get a two over here. And now we can have light blue get out, because light blue- light blue is doing really well. We want to give the others a chance. We want it to be as even of a game as possible. Let's just get down some of these fruits. Let's just get twos, just to get these fruits to come down quickly. There we go, get a two like that. I think I want to have Dark Blue win, and I am going to have Red be in second place. So that means that Yellow is going to be third, and Light Blue or Cyan is going to be- Oh, whoa, 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 Uh, actually, change of plans. Oh, man, I'm so sorry to do this to you, Red. Red, we have to get you out. I'm so sorry to do that to you. I didn't realize that there weren't that many fruits. I thought that we'd be able to just keep getting twos for a while to make the game go fast. Okay, but now I really do want Dark Blue to win, because I need Dark Blue to get these coins. So over here, we'll just bring the fruits down, bring the fruits down a bit at a time. And then we will make Dark Blue win this one, because we can choose whatever we want everyone to do. Imagine if this is how Mario Party was meant to be played. It's like you control all four characters and you just pick who wins. It's kind of nice that you can play against other people or against CPUs. This is a very unique way of playing the game. And man, you know what? My last video where I did something like this, where I was controlling all four characters at once, that got a ridiculous amount of views! I am so shocked at how many people watched that video. It's got almost a million views in a week, that is unbelievable, oh my goodness. And it's still getting a crazy amount of views.
Okay, so blue is moving on up, leaving red behind in fourth place over here. But hey, this is still anybody's game. Everyone still only has one star right now. You know what? Let's take a mushroom right now. If we roll a 10, that would be quite wild. There's no way we're rolling a 10. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? This keeps happening. We keep getting the exact number that we need to reach this star. That was a 1 in 10 chance of that happening, and we got it. I used the mushroom just thinking, okay, we'll get kind of close to the star. There's no way we're reaching it now. How many times has this happened in this game already? Guys, please leave a comment on this video saying that the luck in this game is unbelievable, even though you're playing as all four characters. Every single character is having unbelievable luck here. How do they get these rolls? How do they do it? Okay, so we roll an eight over here, so we're possibly reaching the star next turn. And we are, of course, getting another gold pipe. This is now going to become the battle of the gold pipes. Okay, yellow with 69 coins left. That is very nice. And where's yellow heading? Landing on a red, and there might be a bonus star for most reds. I think one other Yoshi has landed on a red. I don't know who it was. Okay, 10 away. You're not rolling a 10. There's no way you're also rolling a 10. Okay, good, good. I was gonna say, this game's too crazy. Everyone is just getting the exact number that they need. Oh man, let's see, what do we get here? Coins would be great. Nice! 17 coins! Okay, so next is turn 8, then it's turn 9, then it's turn 10 after that. So Blue Yoshi might be able to buy three more stars. Okay, we are using an item here. Not the gold pipe, we're using the double dice block over here. Hopefully, we can also reach the Koopa Troopa. Let's see, 10? Alright, so we already don't even need the second roll to reach the star. 10 and 2. Okay, so that's a 12. Can we reach the Koopa Troopa with that, or are we a bit before him? I'm not sure. Uh, I don't think that we are reaching the Koopa Troopa, but... Red is getting its second star. That brings red from fourth place up into second place over here. Everyone's got at least one gold pipe. Dark blue, Yoshi, still has two gold pipes left. Okay, what do we get here? Coins would be great. I would love coins here. 12 would be perfect. Custom dice block, eh, maybe that'll come in handy. But man, dark blue is a real, real contender here. Yellow's also a good competitor in this board. Okay, and it's everyone versus yellow here. What are we gonna have? We have Boulder Ball. So you know what we're gonna do? Here's what we're gonna do. Yellow wants to crush us all. Everyone's just gonna run straight up. You know what? Yellow just has a vengeance against Dark Blue right now. Yellow's like, I don't care if anyone wins. I just want to squish Dark Blue as much as possible. That's what Yellow's doing here. Oh, the boulder disappears. Didn't get to squish it one more time. Yeah, I'm doing this just so the team of three, everyone here gets 10 coins. Oh yeah, and we do want red to get more coins and dark blue. Yellow does have enough coins right now. Not super worried about yellow's coins. Man, look at this. Yellow's actually in last place now. Kind of surprising. How the tides are turning and only three turns are left. Okay, just don't land on an event space and everything will be fine. Or wait. Should I just use the you-know-what right now, or should I roll normally? Should I use the gold pipe now, or roll normally? You know what, let's roll normally for a turn. A three, wait, 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 wait. Oh, duel! A duel! Oh, man! Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. You know what? You know what? We have to keep our honor. We will duel for all of the coins that we possibly can. Red has all of its coins at stake. Maybe this will be a duel where it ends up being a complete tie and the coins go back to everyone. Or maybe there will be a winner. Let's see, what minigame is it? Okay, it's the space one. Look how dark the Yoshis look in space here. So I'm guessing this one will be a perfect tie. I've done this one. Oh, wait. Okay, okay, okay. Let's be careful. Let's be careful, everybody. Let's be careful. Let's get up here. Which screen should I focus on? Get me in there. Nice. Get me in there. Nice. Get me in there. Okay, okay, okay. They're doing alright so far. Okay. Oh, I wanted to squeeze through there. Okay, what about here? Can I go up through here? No! Oh, man. We got hit. This is so silly. At least when they get hit, they do both get hit. Whoa! Whoa! One of them got hit, but the other one didn't. What's going to happen now? Red is actually breaking through. Red is breaking through. One of them got hit, but the other one didn't. It looks like there is a slight difference in terms of the joystick inputs and red is breaking through red is going to be the winner cyan is just completely falling apart now red is the winner was there a slight difference between the two i've played this mini game before and i did have a complete tie with both characters so i'm actually so surprised at that oh my goodness somehow red wins that oh my goodness red with 44 coins now 
Light blue being left with just 50 now, but lands on a lucky space. Still with a gold pipe, could get some coins maybe. Gets 12 coins. So Cyan still can't afford the next star, so not too big of a deal. Yellow six away, as long as you don't roll a five, you're okay. Just a two, all right, all right, all right. So hopefully next turn you can reach the star and then the turn after that you could use your gold pipe. That would be the ideal situation. Gets 15 more coins, that's a lot of coins. Having a lot of coins right there. Blue, go ahead. Just don't roll a four. Get a five or greater. A three. Ah, oh, that's so sad. Wait a minute. That's actually uh, kind of bad. Because now you've got two gold pipes and only two turns are left. So it's like you should just use your gold pipes. So blue will probably only be able to get to three stars max instead of four. All right. Red just rolls normally over here trying to get a few coins over here. Maybe using the gold pipe this turn might have been actually a better move. But we'll see. We'll see what we want to do here. We'll see. Let's see. Is everyone on blue? No, one person is on red. So let's see. What kind of minigame do we have? One versus three over here. And the minigame is... Look away! Stop. Wait, it's actually uh, impossible to make the team of three win over here. Because no matter what way I look, the everyone's out in the first round. Everyone's out in the first round because everyone copies that exactly. So dark blue wins that no matter what I do. Only two turns are left now. Things are getting very intense over here. And you know what? Now might be a good time to use the gold pipe. I'm going to use the gold pipe. That's what we're going to do over here. Maybe there might be a situation where it would be worth saving it to next turn. But hey, maybe we could get a bunch of coins. Maybe we could somehow get another gold pipe. And then we would want to use the gold pipe for the next turn. And we wouldn't be able to use two gold pipes in a turn. So we might as well use this gold pipe right now since we are this Yoshi. But Yellow Yoshi, for Yellow Yoshi, it might be worth rolling normally because Yellow Yoshi might be able to pass by this star. I think that's what Yellow Yoshi should do, in fact. Okay, but it looks like Cyan Yoshi probably isn't getting one more star after this, unfortunately. Oh, but there is a warp block. So anything can still happen. Anything can still happen here. Okay, Yellow is four away from this star, but I'm not going to use the gold pipe right now, hoping we could get at least a four. And eight. Okay, good. So we get a star this turn and next turn with a gold pipe, we also get a star. So that's pretty good. It was worth the risk of rolling over there. For blue, since blue has two gold pipes and there are only two turns left, even though blue is only two spots away from this star, blue should use the gold pipes right now. So yeah, even though I'm two away right now, I know this might look kind of silly, but there are only two turns left in the game. Unless I choose to add more turns to the board, I could do that. But let's just do this. Let's just use the gold pipe right now. Let's do this. Pop in here. Teleport speed one spot forward. Every All the Yoshis are like, what? What are you doing? But now we get a guaranteed roll. Now we are guaranteed to get this star over here. And we're also almost guaranteed to get a star next turn, depending on how many coins we have. Because we still do have one more gold pipe. So yellow's getting another star next turn, most likely. Blue's getting another star next turn, most likely. And where is red? Where is red right now? And we're landing on an item space. Wonder what we'll get. Oh, we can get a... Oh, a boo bell would be very evil. Let's see. Let's try for that. And we got the boo bell. Okay, maybe we can steal coins or a star. There's also a dueling glove in the middle, but I thought, hey, let's go for the boo bell. So we've got, oh wait, but you can't use two items together, can you? I don't think you could use two items in the same turn. Okay, so where do we want to go? 17 away from the star. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm actually not going to use the gold pipe this turn. I'm actually going to use the custom dice block and I'm going to roll a 10. And this might be a bit surprising, but here's why I'm doing that. We can make some progress towards possibly getting the most spaces traveled bonus star. And instead of buying a gold pipe, because we already do have a gold pipe and this is the second last turn, I'm actually just gonna buy the cheapest thing in the shop. I'm just gonna buy a mushroom for three coins because there might be a bonus star for most items purchased. So this way we're passing by the shop one more time, purchasing another item. And next turn, Red is going to use the gold pipe. Next turn, everyone except for Syed is using a gold pipe. It's kind of crazy. Three characters are all using gold pipes on the final turn. Okay, let's see. What mini game do we have? We have bumper balls. Wait. Uh, what do I What do I even do? Because if anyone moves one way, everyone moves that way. So I guess, do I just stand here, make everyone win together? Or wait, wait, wait. Can I get them to kind of group together? Maybe I can... 
Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, careful, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Let's see, I kinda wanna, oh no, 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 don't fall yellow, don't fall yellow! No yellow, don't fall! Don't fall yellow, you're so close, no yellow, stop it! Look at its little feet there, stop moving yellow! No yellow, don't move! Yellow, yellow please slow down yellow! Oh, thank goodness, thank goodness, its feet are coming back. Wait, no, is it still moving? Is it still moving? Yellow, please don't run off. Yellow, there are only 20 seconds to go. Please don't move. Please don't move. Everyone else is standing still. We need you to survive with us. Yellow, please. Yellow, please survive. It looks like it is moving a few picks. Okay, but I think it'll be able to survive. Yellow, please don't run off. Please, yellow, please. Please, yellow. Everyone survive. Thank goodness. Okay, so everyone gets coins. That's so lovely. Ah, what a win. That's scary. Oh, man. All right, so everyone gets 10 coins for that, which is very nice. Just yesterday, I made a video about making everyone Luigi colored in Mario Party 9 and step it up and seeing what happens if everyone does absolutely nothing. And that was a super fun video. Because when everybody does nothing, you... Oh, wait, I probably should have used the warp block. Why didn't I use the warp block? I guess I was, I was doing, I was working too hard on commentary. Great, and we get Thwob's Toll is half. So even though Cyan Yoshi is in first place right now in the final turn, the others might come back now. All right, but it is the final turn, so it's time for all of us to start using our gold pipes over here. Gold pipe number one is used by Yellow Yoshi over here. That means that Yellow Yoshi is going to have three stars. Now, wait a minute. This actually means after this turn, Everyone is going to have three stars. Every single person is going to have three stars. So Yellow Yoshi gets his third star over here. Congratulations, Yellow Yoshi. And we get another 10 coins from passing by here. And Yellow Yoshi's actually in first place right now. And even, oh, oh man. Oh, wait, oh, but that's just Cyan, okay. So Cyan isn't able to buy a star, but we will again wager as many coins as possible, 27 coins. So that's all of Cyan Yoshi's coins. So Yellow might not be in first place after this battle, or Yellow might be even more in first place than before, having an even bigger lead. Ah, oh, it's this racing mini game. So that means that probably, this is our duel over here. This probably means that it is going to be a perfect tie. Because every time that I've played this mini game with everyone connected to the same controller, it has been a tie. So let's see if that also happens this time. Let's see, just trying to get as many boosts as possible. And you know what? I'm paying attention to the character on the left, but I guess I could pay attention to the screen on the right now. You guys could let me know in a comment which character you are paying attention to when there are mini games like this. It's like, do you switch back and forth to see if they're really tied? Are they really tied? Let's see who wins. Winners. Yeah, both of them win. Both of them win, and both of them are pretty happy about this, so it looks like all the coins go back to everyone. So this was unlike the previous duel that we had. Everyone gets all of their coins back. Man, I really hope I can beat myself at the end. I wonder who's going to be the winner here. Because this is still anyone's game. And what do we get from the lucky space? Ten coins. It's not Thwomp's Toll is half, which is useless on the last turn of the game, luckily. All right, so it is time to use our golden pipe over here. The next character is using the golden pipe for this turn. So we are also getting our third star over here. Another character to have star number three here. But man, this is... All going to come down to bonus stars. There are going to be two bonus stars given out. Normally when you have a 10 turn game, there are two bonus stars that are given out at the end. And the stars can go to multiple people or sometimes the stars go to nobody. Well, let's see, okay, we're seven away. That's funny, if we were one spot closer, we could have actually just used the mushroom. We could still use the mushroom and reach the star as long as we roll at least the two, so there's only a one in 10 chance that we don't reach it. But we are still going to use the gold pipe just to be safe over here. Let's use this gold pipe over here, and let's see where we are going to go. Let's see, what do we roll? A six. Do we land on anybody? I wonder if we land on anybody else. But we are, of course, purchasing the star, and all four players have three stars now, so it looks like I'm putting up a good challenge for myself. I'm making it difficult to beat myself because, oh, oh, and here's someone that lands on the event space. Who landed on the earlier event space? Because there were two event spaces that were landed on in this game. There was someone near the beginning of the game, I don't remember who it was, and right now, Red landed on it, and there might be a bonus star for most event spaces, so I don't know if it's going to Red and someone else, or just Red. Okay, and it's a one versus three mini game. What one do we have? It is... Title Toss! Okay, who do I make win this? 
Who do I want to win this? Because we could all just stand here and then the team of three would win. Or I can try and take out myself like this. Yeah, okay, it's down to just the two of us. So who's gonna win this? Oh! Oh man! Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. It's so weird because it's like when you jump to dodge the waves like this, then they, uh, then Red Yoshi already sends out another wave after that. So it's like if you're constantly jumping like this, but yeah, I had to let, it looks like the team of three won over here. But yeah, it looks like the team of three wins this one over here just after some little experimenting there. But hey, this is anybody's game. It all comes down to the bonus stars. Let's see. Yahoo! Win it all! First, let's go over the bonuses! First bonus is... Item bonus. Who used the most items? I don't know if this is going to be a tie. We all used a lot of items. I don't know who's getting this one. Let's see. Red Yoshi. Okay. Okay, so so far Red Yoshi might be winning this one. Red Yoshi's at four stars, everyone else is at three. What is the next bonus star? If someone else get, how many coins does Red Yoshi have? I don't know who's winning this. Let's see, Slowpoke bonus. That's probably not red. Who does the bonus go to? Maybe Cyan? Blue Yoshi, okay. So that means that Cyan and Yellow are in last place and blue or red are in first place. So who's going to be winning this one, blue or red? Team blue or team red? Oh my goodness. And I imagine that probably a lot of people were cheering for blue and red because those are some pretty cool colors. I, guys, let me know in a comment who you were cheering for. Let's see. Let's see who's the winner. And who's in last? Cyan's in last. Then it's yellow. Now does blue or red win? Let's see. Who is it? Red loses. Blue Yoshi wins. Congratulations, Blue Yoshi with the purple shoes. Oh my goodness! They are literally one coin apart. Look at how close that is, guys. I really put up a good challenge for myself. I'm so happy that I was able to beat myself by a single coin. What a close game. I don't think I've ever seen a game that close in Mario Party Superstars. And it's funny that I had a score like this while playing with myself. I really recommend checking out my Mario Party 10 Bowser Party video. It's a super fun game and we played through every board as Bowser. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day ahead of you and take care everybody. Oh my goodness, there we go, perfect. All right, 100%, let's go. All four characters getting a perfect game, that's pretty cool.